After a half century, an East Texas artist is still perfecting his calling in life. Using wood from Henderson County, he's sharing his faith with people across the country. Our Lane Lucky shows you in this week's Power of Prayer. Alone with his maker. That's how Felix Avalos prefers to work. When you do the work for God, do it in private. So God who sees it in private will see you, will reward you. The artist draws inspiration from quiet introspection. So what I do, you know, I know that it's going to change someone's life. Raw timber comes into his workshop near LaRue and leaves as fine art destined for a higher purpose. Christ on the cross, the Virgin of Guadalupe, saints and angels. These creations are prominently displayed in churches around East Texas and across the country. And that's what the, the images represent, you know, the, uh, the image of God. You can't see him in person, so you, you see it in a wood carving. At 86 years old, Avalos is still perfecting his craft. Totally self-taught, sculpting has become more than a hobby and profession. If you really pray hard and you're really serious, you know, your prayers are answered. These days, he has no shortage of projects, thanks in part to his crowning masterpiece. A 21-foot-tall cross in Clearwater, Florida took two and a half years to complete. In 2001, it was installed outside an office building where more than a half million pilgrims came to see an image of the Virgin Mary reflected in the windows. People there, the shepherds of Christ, he told me that when you heard one man say, I know what my vocation is now. I want to become a priest. So you see, it's, uh, it's opening up people's hearts. But after 50 years, he admits he's slowing down a bit. Two knee replacements, back surgery on my three vertebrae. I got two bolts in my back and uh, two hip replacements. I'm still going. Hauling huge slabs of cedar is physically demanding, but it teaches a valuable lesson. I'll just put up with it, but just tell myself, you know, Christ suffered on the cross for us, and, and he had a lot of pain. He says this painstaking detail directs prayerful attention to moments in the life of Christ. And anything being positive, it comes from God. And that's how I see, you know, I see things in my life and in prayer. This talent is seen as a gift from the ultimate creator, one that's also left Felix at peace with the world. I can't leave this behind, so I got to finish this course first, and then if God wants to take me after this, well, I'm ready to go after I finish. <laughs> Lane Lucky, East Texas News. Felix is currently working on a carving of the 12 apostles for a monastery in Missouri. We would love to hear how the power of prayer has impacted your life. To share your story with us, use your phone's camera to scan the QR code on your screen, or you can head to kltv.com or ktre.com, click on the community tab, and you'll find the power of prayer page there.